Now then, YouTube, Paul Pogba, 87 rated. He, I believe, will be the man I will go for if Enoch and Wepu leaves. Uh, I tried going for him, and we couldn't get him, so we'll try again. We have a lot of tired legs. Kimpembe, Van Dijk, Reguilón are okay. Poisson is two. Mulder we're going to put in. Uh, let's just, before I do this, actually, just check on if we know who we've got in the cup. In Champions League, we do. We're away against Brighton in the uh, Carabao Cup. And we've got AC Milan, Fernabache and Slavia Prague in our Champions League group. That's the plan. Anyway, here we go. Bottom of the table versus top of the table. Mulder is in. Berger is out. Sands is in. Sensei is in along with Tolisso. And Wepu will leave in because it could be his last game for the club. Kane stays. We'll give Brewster a go up front. Ramos can have a rest. Put success on the bench there. Fresher legs on the bench. So in that Poisson back four of Mulder, Kimpembe, Van Dijk, Region, Sands, Sensei, Tolito and Wepu with Kane and Brewster up front. I'm just hoping Bruce doesn't play. I'm hoping he plays well, but I'm hoping he doesn't instantly make me think, damn, I need to play this guy every game as well, because Ramos and Bruce, um, what do you call it, are playing that well that I can't really drop either of them, Ramos or Harry Kane. Let's do it. Enoch and Wepu, great player, but if I get 60 mil for him, 83 rated at 28, he's not going to get any better. Nice from all the until that great strike well saved Kipembe made sure he forced him down the tight angle and obviously trusted his keeper not to be beaten at the near post and as you like to say the last thing you expect is for your keeper to be beaten at his near post from that range so. Brewster to Mwepu, to Tolisso, 1-0 Sheffield United. And this team feels something else. It really does. These little additions, the Kane, the Van Dijk, we feel stronger at the back. We feel more clinical up front. It feels good. These players that we brought in with age and experience rather than youth. Not things I often do very often. That I often go for the youngsters and... Uh, grow them into a like a, an 80 90 rate it's what i usually did for example with how ramos that's my sort of game usually but now we're coming towards the end of this career this is the last or maybe penultimate i mean i'm i'm gonna say it's the last just to be safe but there's a chance we could still have one more season to lisa well struck well saved looking for another oh dear that's really poor it's stefano sensi Brewster, not quite. <laughs> but yeah, because I know that it's either going to be my last season or my next to last season. Ref, probably almost certainly going to be my last full played season. If it's not my last season, some of the games will be simulated. Shocking from Jorge Sands. Virgil just knows where to be all the time. Sensi. Reguilón. Please tell me you've timed that in Wepu. Tolisso. <sighs> Clearly enjoying playing at that more attacking role in midfield. The first person and the first team to score against us is Bournemouth and Geldhardt. Newcastle and Aston Villa have played. They can't manage it. Fucking Bournemouth. from Brewster Position lost. 
Chiefs are defending. Well, I'm hearing a change to the scoreline in the Everton game. Alex Scott can tell us more. Enoch and Wepu. We'll see what he wants to do with that transfer offer. 60 million accepted from Leicester City. For me, they can have him for 60 mil. He's good, but he's not 60 mil good. He's 28. He's not going to get any better. I'll get Pogba in. I've got Gavi in for the youth side of midfield. Kane! Sensi for the tight angle. A tad too tight. Jorge Sanz has been wank, beyond wank. We've dominated possession and shots with uh, Well done. Bit sloppy at the back today. A couple of times they've got through. Ah, you nubbed! Why? Stop it, EA. Stop it. There. Harry Kane running on the outside. Well-timed run on side. I don't have a problem with that. What I have a problem with, I press through ball. And then Kane then starts, stops running outside his man and quickly goes inside. And that point is when they can intercept. And that happens so much. The run being made. And I'm thinking, yeah, okay. We're going we're gonna to play the ball through to them now. They, he's made his run. It's a good run. And then just as I play the ball, Van, uh, Van Dijk. As well, there and Kimpembe completes the job. He changes his run last minute. Fuck off. Winds me up. Here's Brewster. Hit it early. Struck well. Bryce Samberingo for Bournemouth. But yeah, if you can't tell, I'm pretty infuriated. Okay. Oh. Unlucky there, Harry Kane. Now PSG have been busy in the transfer market. The contract situation has been signed and sealed. His verge should be available as early as their next game, Stuart. Well, the figure being reported is about. Oh, the chance is on, Stuart. Oh, Pembe in the way again. Nice. His sand skinny. Play a pass to the right player. He can. His step. Oh, it's unlucky. If that's anyone else. Stefano said to probably get a bit more strength on that. Uh, or whoever it is gets a bit more strength on that, but he's not exactly tall. Stefano Sensi. Keeper come out, or oh, don't, that's fine too. Sensi does well there. Kane. Well, Brewster, head it on. Keep going. Come here. Well done. Oh, fuck off, I won the ball. Get foot, ref, you cunt. Don't have a clue, do you? Sands, it's Toliso, it's Kane, it's Brewster. Can't believe I'm not winning here. ball through Harry Kane fucking get in just slamped it as hard I could as I did there bang two on and Harry Kane has got three and three in three Premier League games fantastic come on do you want to bring off Tolisso bring on Gabby bring on Uber bring on Courtney 70th minute triple saw Brewster with the ball through to Kane there. Kane took one touch, two touch. The third touch was a near post lamp. Lamped it as hard as I could. Really good strike. And it's now 2-1 Sheffield United. Get in. 3-3 three and three for Harry Kane. Tolisso, Brewster and Regiona coming off. Maxwell Corney, Deli Uber and Gavi are coming on. We've got the youth new signing in midfield 
with Gavi. I've got the experience to sign in midfield. Um, if uh, Enoch and Matthew leaves. Keepers, good hands. Out to Gabby. And down the line to Enoch Mwepu in what could potentially be his last game for the club. It's a good ball in. Uber. Kipembe, well done. What a hands. Some Mwepu. Who with the ball, Corne? Shit. Five minutes to go. And Bournemouth are attacking and playing like Prime Barca. Kimpembe is not making a tackle when I'm asking him to. Virgil is beaten. This guy's unstoppable. Well done, keeper, because that was bullshit. Do not think it wasn't, because it was. Virgil with an absolutely fucking sublime ball. Corney looking for the same, and it's fucking pathetic from Maxwell Corney. There was nothing else on there. Had to do it. Stoppage time is now upon us to try and win that. Probably won't. Yeah, just so happens to keep it and then attack with it. Poisson clears full time. Yes, it is. Get in there. 2 1. Fucking made hard work of that. Let's, let's not beat up in a bush. Not the best game. We'll, we'll take it. Well, I mean, we, did, we, fl we, we created more there and we deserve to win there just as much, if not more, than we did in the 3 0 battering of Villa. But yeah, we'll see anyway. Before I say goodbye, we've got transfer deadline day to get through. First of all, we need to see if we sell uh, Enoch and Wepu. Um, I have got some left in the old. And Wepu has been sold. 60 mil, 53 are going into my funds. So I've now got 73 mil. Okay. Um, let's go to the transfer hub. 58, so I've got 73 mil. I'm not going to go any more than 70. We've got to try 60 first. Counter. 70. They aren't budging in that case. Paul Pogba is not the one. Transfer hub. Let's go on to, sorry, this is like going to be a slightly longer video. Let's have a look in league and see if these players are missing out on Harter. He's only just gone because he wasn't there. Let's go in eh? Blanco, that's okay. Henry Chan. Uh, Ishmael Kulubali, no. Anything worth having? I'm looking at any option. Um, he's a good player. Jelovic, Matthias Jensen, solid. I'll know when I see him. Um, there's nothing to shout home about in the uh, French League. Let's try the Bundesliga. Getson, decent. Enzo Fernandez looks decent. Fafana, decent. Gerson. All these exciting me too much. Need to be under 60, really. If PA not going to happen. No. No. Berman's okay. Ward Prowse, decent player. There's no. Nothing. Syria. Got to be something in Syria. 
I ain't got time. Varela, very good, but no chance. I ain't got time to do the um, um scouting, so I need someone I know is going to be good. Goretzka. Kovacic. Cruz. Celso is decent. No one really making me go, yes, you. Just part of 33. Again, I don't mind a slightly older player. If they aren't high rated, I'm not interested. Chushibon, player, but yeah, that looks like he's well at our price range. Uh, no. La Liga? What other leagues are there? La Liga. Bellingham, great player, but yeah, massively out of our price range. Coquelin, not very good. Dominguez, okay. Herrera. You look okay. 70 mil. Well, out of our price range. Coke, no. Skopje, no. Martinez, no, 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 no. Ben Osborne. Exquil Palacios. Okay, but no. Cavanius, no. Keta, no. And Ramsey, absolutely not. Rakic, decent. Sabitzer, decent. No. Sanchez, too much. Your Tiedemann's out of our league. No, yeah, yeah, no. Frankie Dion, massively out of our price range. I think I'm going to go with, if I can, um, this Yangel Herrera, because he's, as you can see, versatile. I can't afford more than 70. I got rid of Enoch and Weppy for 60 mil. So I'm going to, he's currently valued at that. So I'm going to offer 55. He's one better rating at the same age. You want Sensei counter. I'm going to remove that. Um, 50, we'll go 60, 60 and a half, 75, um, 72 and a half, great, he's one better rated, he's the same age, And he's versatile. He looks good. Anyway. He's got to be important. His current wage is 57. So he is. That's a good player. I like the look of this guy. We'll accept that. And that's what he wants. Um, counter. Move bonus. Fine. And we've now got Yangel Herrera as a replacement for, um, where is he? There we are. Perfect. Sand. That, I believe, is us done. And I'm sorry this video is 50, uh, 20 minutes instead of the usual 30, 40 minutes. If you want, enjoy watching me search through players trying to find someone, fair enough. But we have got a new signing now. And I think that will do us very nicely indeed. That's us done. I've got summit in the office. Three things in the office. Um, transfer offer for not you. Swap deal. No. Who is this P now anyway? 82 rated right, made it 23. No. Uh, and one Bissaka, 150 million. No. And Reggio. No. Okay. So they're all players that never in a month of Sundays I'm going to sell. Uh, you see there, Kane, Gavi, Van Dijk and Herrera. And obviously Ober on contract expiry. The players I've got in. Phillips, Moussa, Watkins... Um, Ishmael Koulibaly and Enoch and Wepi were players I've got rid of and obviously also getting rid of Bass Hendricks on contract expiry. Poisson, uh, I mean look at some of the 
prices people are willing to pay for me players, but no. I've got some of the best players in the world in this team, and I plan on keeping them in this team to keep us at the top of the league. I've done so well. I've built one hell of a squad, and I intend to keep it like that. Taliso transfer offer. He's 32 years of age, 27 mil. I am going to accept that. And if he goes, he can leave in the um, January. I believe I bought him on contract expire anyway, didn't I? So that's profit. If he leaves, great. I'll get a replacement in January. If he doesn't, you know, I can deal with that. So he has gone to Liso. He will be leaving in January. But not now, so I don't need to worry about that. Coming back in to our next game will be on 2026, September, Saturday the 12th. We've got Everton, three games, three wins. The only other two teams to do that are Man City and Spurs. And the top four are actually a bit more realistic. Man United and Man City in there as well as Spurs. Uh, we've got Everton at home, then AC Milan at home, Arsenal and um, Brighton away. So, yes. Lots to look forward to. But anyway, enough of that. Apologies for vi this video being slightly longer than usual. We've just got that last transfer done. Hangel Herrera. Looks a very solid, versatile midfielder. Anywhere in midfield, attack, defence or whatever. All good. Uh, that's our transfer business done. Corentin Taliso will be leaving. But he will be going in January. And then we'll find a replacement if necessary. Thank you very much. Like, subscribe. I'll see you next episode for Everton at home.